hey 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 welcome back to my channel so as you can see today i'm bringing to you the famous korean dalgona candy without wasting time let's just get started first i'll get a non-stick pan and i'll come in with about four tablespoonful of white sugar i'll get a greaseproof paper and put it on my countertop this is where i'll put the candy afterwards i'm also going to be needing a pinch of baking soda now i'll put on my lowest flame don't forget we're doing this on the lowest flame possible now i'll put my sugar onto the flame with the help of a wooden stick i'll mix it up if the flame is too high it's going to burn i'll mix it up till all the sugar has melted So as you can see, the sugar has melted very well. I'll just go ahead and put off the flame. I will drop in a pinch of baking soda. This is about half a teaspoon and I'll give this a quick mix. Now I'll pour it onto my greaseproof paper. I must say you must do this in bits as it dries so early and it's going to be hard before you can even ship it up. I don't have the metallic stump, so I'll use my drinking glass. Now I'll come in with my cookie cutter. I've got here a heart shape. With the second one, I'll come in with a star shape. So ladies and gentlemen, it is done. I must say, these are so delicious. You can't stop at one. As you can see, it is easy to make, but if you want to make a lot, you need more time as you can't make them in large quantities. So I hope you like those and I hope you are going to give this delicious candy recipe a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye.